this is an object detection model using which we detect uh, the objects. It detects the box uh, in a single go and marks as many boxes as possible. We have curated this model to detect only six objects which belongs to two classes. I was not really comfortable with doing hands-on but now I feel hands-on is what exactly is important for you to, uh, to have a grow, real growth. I've learned to learn and I've learned to unlearn. I've learned to understand new things and to pursue my talents with even more passion. And last of all, I've learned to become independent because AM has given me an opportunity to come all the way from Chandigarh to Bombay and stay here for such a long time with so great talented minds. And then polish my own self. Earlier, I was not even sure of what my capabilities are. But this time of seven weeks has helped me to shape my picture of future. So, it has helped me to decide that I will be pursuing for my master's degree. And it also told me that I'm a patient person. I know how to discover things. I know how to understand things. And I know that I will be able to do something great. Instead of using ESP32 CAM module, we can use uh, the RPI camera and uh, instead of the Arduino Uno, we can use RPI itself so that the computational power is fair enough to run the object detection model and also uh, to uh, reduce the latency. Make sure that you check the motor driver if it is compatible with the motors given because we were allotted N20 motors with a, uh, motor, a stepper motor driver which wasn't compatible to synchronize the task and you won't be able to guess what exactly is making your um, hampering the movement of the board. So make sure uh, you check the clearance, second is the motor and third is the sensor. I have never seen any other institute or any uh, environment that is providing this exposure and this quick services of providing us instruments, giving us the freedom to choose the instrument and uh, test it, to work on it and give the exposure that is actually needed for uh, the embedded systems and real robotics world. Meeting so many great minds from the best of the best institutes throughout the country, from IITs, NIT, so many prestigious institutes. I don't think any other platform gives you this opportunity to meet at one single place, work together, brainstorm and invent something that might just blow everyone else's mind. For me, all the technical presentations and sessions that we had, they were actually very interactive. Earlier, all these concepts and topics were just a little blob of paint on my canvas. What Kavi sir told us, that people will be hunting for jobs but there will be less people who want to get the jobs and I was really inspired by this who stays in India and actually does a, a startup for to provide a shelter to other people. Yandra is actually a learning internship and an internship in real sense. Here mentors are really mentored. They are telling us to do stuff in way it is to be done. They are uh, no way making us feel that we don't have the knowledge of anything. Rather, they teach us. They help us explore each and every concept and then tell us to implement it. This is what I haven't uh, found in any other internship. When I leave this place, I will have a lot of skills with me. Skills that have been polished by me.